Hey everyone, I'm Megan Remblack and welcome to my channel, Meg Rem Softball. Um, there's going to be no balls on the cones. We're going to work through the sweeping backhand. Okay, I know we haven't really talked about backhands a lot yet, so a sweeping backhand. What I mean by that, it's one of those balls that it's a little bit to my right, I'm going to have to backhand it, but it's a slow roller. So it's not one of those where it's like so fast where I have to go over to my right. It's one that I have to charge and work through it. So what I mean by that, as you come up to the ball, your left foot's gonna be in front and your glove's gonna be probably right by that left foot, okay? Because it's a slow roller, you have to work through it. Yes? Um, it's, you can, it just depends. It depends on the runner, how hard it's hit. Um, but for right now, let's just do sweeping. So you're coming up. So again, it's a slow uh, ground ball to my right. I have to charge and I have to do a backhand. I'm going up to it. My left foot's in front. My glove is right by my left foot. I'm working through it and I'm throwing. So for this drill, we're gonna work on the sweeping backhand. The first two, I'm gonna do without a ball. The third one, after I get past that second one, coach is gonna roll it and I'm gonna feel it. So I'm gonna be here. My glove is out. I'm not going any higher than my knees. Exactly what we did earlier. So I'm going from here up to that first green cone, pretending it's a ball, working through the ball, coming up like I'm gonna throw, set my feet. Coming up to the second cone, pretending there's a ball right there, working through it, and then coach is gonna roll it, you're gonna roll it in the knee, I'm gonna field it, throw, second net. Any questions on that? I really want you to focus on work, what your glove is doing, and your eyes are behind the ball. You're not doing this, and just looking where you're gonna throw the ball. You're here, over exaggerate through it, come up like you're gonna throw it for those first two, and then the third one you'll actually throw. It. So this is gonna be the crossover back step. So when you would use this in a game, let's say you're shortstop, and a ball is hit really far and deep, like kind of like by third base. That means I have to run very far and I'm kinda of gonna to have to reach for it. So a crossover back or Crossover backhand is when you go to a ball, it's really, really far, you're going to cross over with your left foot. Think about far lunge. So that's when you would use your crossover. Does that make sense? Okay, so for this drill, we're going to be in our crossover stance. My left foot is in front, you're going to be on your right knee. And when you feel the ball in your crossover backhand, your ball or the glove is going to be right by your left foot. You don't want to get to a ball and be way back here or way in front, nice and stiff. We don't want stiff. We want nice and loose. I got bend in my elbow right by my left foot. So you're going to be here. Coach is going to roll your ball right to your glove. You're going to field it, work through it, and then throw. So this year it's really important that you see the ball all the way into your glove. Because you don't want to stand up too soon. If you stand up, that ball's going right in your glove. So he's rolling that. You wait, wait, wait. Field it, work through the ball, come up like you're gonna, or not like you're gonna, but you are gonna throw. 